Hey there, this is the Maritime Mystic, and today I just got these delivered to my door, and I haven't opened them yet, so I'm going to do one of those unboxing <laughs> things. So I have the original map deck um, from Colette, as you can see. I've used it a little bit. It's a little bit worn out, and I was fortunate enough that I got to meet her one time so I took the cards with me and she signed um, I had two decks with me and she signed the books for two of the decks and this is one of them here that she actually signed for me when I got to meet her so that was pretty cool and I've got the other deck here just to compare um, you know what the differences might be between the old deck and the new one. So that's the original there. So let's have a look at the new one and see what it's about. A little hard to open the first time. There we go. There's the book. Maybe she'll sign this one someday. <laughs> Is a little bit different. It's a little different. I don't think the other one have the pictures. Yeah, the other one had the pictures of the cards in black and white, which I don't see in this one. Let me see if I'm correct. Yeah, they don't have the pictures of the cards, just the number and the name of the card. So, which is good because let me see if the print is any different in size. Let's see. Mm, the print's about the same size. Maybe a little tiny bit bigger. Bigger is better when you're reading a lot. So, here we go with the... Oh, that's pretty on the back. What's the back of this one? Okay, so they changed the back. I'm going to tear it. Oh, well, I'm going to tear it. So I'm not going to use that part anyways. Ever again. Okay. So, these are really pretty. I like that. It's the same basic color, though. Same basic color, but they really honed in on that nice aqua turquoise color. Goblins come together. I remember that card in the other deck. That's a little bit different in this one. Slow and steady. Some of the um, some of the um, pictures are very much the same, but I think they've changed some of them up a little bit. One ring circus. Yeah, there's a few that are different. But I do I do remember the lighthouse one from the other deck, and it looks the same. I don't know where it went now. Oh. Yeah, so yeah, they're a lot the same, but there are some differences. And I see that there it is there. Yeah, I remember that one from the other deck. Um, but the pictures go right out to the edge instead of having an edge around them. I think these ones do. These ones do. These This deck has a frame edge around the edge, so which it also has on the back. Cool. Yeah. So you can see more of the picture this way. The picture's bigger. And there's the differences in the two. Yeah. Bone collector. So there's the first card, for instance. So they've made the image bigger so you can see the details in the images more. It's just a little bit bigger. And then the bottom, they've got the bottom, they've got the um, the text is a little different. It's got a different background. It does stand out better. It does. So let me see. Did they have it the same? Yeah, the same color on all them on the bottom text. But it's it's bigger, it's easier to read, and the number stands out better 
in black on this one. Numbers are thicker. They're more bold. Bigger, easier to see. Yeah. Very pretty. Still a little shiny. Still the same good quality. Might be a little might be a little difference in the in the thickness. Just a little bit, not a lot. Which that'll be good for shuffling though, right? They're nice and shiny slippery, so they'll be easy to shuffle. Let's see what comes out first. Very first card pulled from this deck. What is it going to be? I'm just gonna take a, oh, okay, there it is. Wide open, wide open. Let's go right straight to the book and see what wide open means. Wide open. So there's a little blurb at the beginning of it. Um, and then and then the card so this appeared to be upright in the upright position so it says you are free to express your uniqueness to the world and share in all the bounty of life's endless possibilities and in the upright position this card means all manner of opportunities are presented to you at this time the wide open card is a signal that you're able to truly manifest your dreams and that your goals are in sight. Well, that's good news. <laughs> and don't remain small and contracted. Instead, expand your horizons beyond what you believe to be your limitations. You have a unique voice that needs to be expressed in the world. The universe is supportive of new ideas and approaches at this time. So speak up and speak out. This card is the sign of the maverick who freely roams the wide open space of possibility. Allow for a greater vision to replace old ideas as you dream a grander dream. Wow, that's an awesome first card to have. Always note the first card that I pull in the deck because it'll often be what we call a stalker card for a while and it'll often keep popping up and keep popping up. But it's the uh, it's the first card is the connection with the deck and for me this is going to represent what this deck is going to help me do and it's its strongest message for me right from the very beginning so perhaps it'll also mean something to you and um, so that's the card that came up first in this deck for me that's the deck that's the book beautiful box that it's in and that's the comparison to um, what the original looked like as well and my signed book with the original who knows maybe someday i'll meet up with her again and i'll get this book signed but for now um that's the card that came out today and i'll use this um in future to bring some messages to everyone so i hope you enjoyed that that's the enchanted map deck by colette baron reed have a great day.